We travel the world looking for fun and new adventures. I'm Carrie. I'm Dave. We are the cast and the crew and do all the filming ourselves. Welcome to American Travelers. Today we're driving to Hilo. See those wild rams? They're everywhere. The road that goes through the center of the island is called the Saddle Road. And you climb to over 6,000 feet. Low visibility from fog or rain is very common. As we get into Hilo, we're excited for our tour with Forest Trail Tours. Their office is located in a little shopping area right off the main highway. Harrison is our tour guide. These trees are put in in 1933 or started uh, being planted in 1933. Many celebrities came to this island and started this tradition. This is our infamous Babe Roots Banyan Tree. So I guess you would call it the Banyan Tree Hall of Fame. We're stopping now to check out the Leo Kalani Gardens, but first we take in the ocean view of Hilo. Harrison points out... Mokuola, which is Coconut Island. Coconut Island and this parking lot are all part of the gardens, and it's a great place for travelers to take some photos. The Asian-influenced architecture is really breathtaking in person. This is all part of the tour, and we would recommend coming here to soak up the spiritual calmness of this area. So we, we kind of go everywhere, so we're, we're having a lot of fun. Harrison is taking us to our first waterfall on some private property. Hawaii has 11 of the 13 climate zones. Did he say 11 of the 13 climate zones? I guess that would mean it would be snowing on Mauna Loa and hotter than H-E double hockey sticks at the beach. Not all tour companies on the island have access to the waterfalls we're seeing today. We're traveling up this small tree-lined road and it is so beautiful. So how many waterfalls do you think are on the big island? Is it 5, 13, or 70? You guessed it, 13. Part of Palm, this is a remnant sugar cane. They got That's sugar cane. Yeah, sugar cane there. Uh, they do plant that for uh, juice, yeah, they, they juice it, tea leaves, citrus, and coffee here. And of course, he's showing us macadamia nut trees. We just had to stop and check it out. Macadamia nut, in its natural state. Hey, look at Dave, there's a young one right here. They uh, harvest these nuts by hand. They look for them on the ground and they come through and they pick these all up. So this is how we used to do this when we were kids, yeah? We'd go in a mac nut field, walk around, find some stones, grab some nuts, and we got a free, free snack. Oh, nice. Heading on, we see a lot of beautiful farm country. As we say in the biz, great eye candy. So they squeeze oil out of those beans, and this is called the palm what? Palm oil. Palm oil. And then what's this out in the field here? Cacao. Cacao. And what is cacao? Uh, they make cocoa, chocolate. Next on our tour, Harrison takes us to another private waterfall, which is located at Lenny's Place. Just imagine owning your own waterfall. Aloha, I'm Harrison with Hawaii Forest and Trails, and I'm taking Dave and Carrie to Kulani Apia Falls. We break out the drone for some awesome footage of the falls. I just happened to catch a rainbow in the shot. The one thing that we found is that we saw a lot of rainbows while on our trip. We're doing the waterfall. Yeah, this is one of the most beautiful waterfalls we've ever seen. So we're gonna use the big camera. Oh, I think Dave is a little over the top excited about this. Just happens Lenny's place is a B&B called the Inn at Kulaniapia Falls. So on your next trip, you may want to look them up and book a room. Now that's living the dream. And now on to another waterfall. Harrison brought us to the Keimu Kunaka Falls. Here at Hawaii Forest and Trails, we have customized tours. At this location here, we got a helicopter comes takes you on a helicopter tour, drops you off here, and we pick you up at this gazebo. Well, let's do one more with a little more smile. We offer custom tours, too. <laughs> <laughs> okay, we're back on the road to yet another waterfall, and this is one of the most famous on the island and open to the public. We just happen to be on a private farm across from the public side of the falls. My name is Ala Amoy Keola Nui, and we are at Rainbow Falls, and I am a part of Oki Farms. Um, Oki Farms, we were established in the early 2000s, and we're a tree crop farm, meaning mac nuts, coffee, citrus, tropical fruits, hearts of palm, cacao, macadamia nuts. What we do is, when it's time to harvest, the nuts actually drop from the tree. Um, after they drop from the tree, our pickers pick them one by one and fill up the five gallon buckets. 
So I have these for the guests, okay? And so what we're gonna do is we're gonna get a chance to open them. Okay, there we go. And here's your beautiful piece of 100% Hawaiian macadamia nuts. So right here we have some hearts of palm, or the scientific name is peach palm. Yum. <laughs> Up next we have longan, which is a tropical fruit. It's along the lines with the lychee and rambutan, and then inside there's a seed in the middle, okay? So you want to be careful. Um, longan to me, it has more like a melon taste. I would like to thank Ala Mui, oh you know I can't pronounce the rest of her name, for treating us to our nuts and fruits. We had an amazing time with Hawaiian Forest Trails Tour Company. Harrison was great. Oh, on to our next adventure. Thanks for watching American Travelers.